Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. Um, I've been meaning to film, film this video for a little while. Um, but yeah, so Hobby's downstairs watching the Grand Prix. So if you hear any TV noise, that's what that is. But it gives me a bit of time to actually get this filmed and um, to share with you. So I know lots of us were just like makeup mad out. We were just kind of a bit obsessed with buying things. And I've been looking on the Black Friday sales and thinking, oh, I need to get this box, I need to get that. Oh, this one's coming out, there's a limited edition box. And I've actually just stopped and thought, wow, just what's going on here? And I'm just about to show you why I need to just stop, pause, breathe, count to 10 or 100 and think, do I need to buy this? So something's just clicked in my brain and I'm just thinking, why are you buying all this stuff? What What's the point? I've got more stuff already that I can ever possibly use, I think. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just reach you around really quick, well, quite as quickly as I can through all like my makeup and cosmetic drawers and things and just show you what I've got. And um, yeah, we'll sort of go from there and work out, do I really need any more stuff? Uh, I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to go on a no buy 2019. So I'm going to still stay on with my um, beauty. So, so the, the beauty subscriptions I have now, I'm going to continue. I'm not going to buy any others. So I'll remain on what I'm subscribed to, which is quite a few because at the moment I'm subscribed to Birchbox, Glossybox, Latest in Beauty, Look Fantastic. Look Incredible Standard Box, The Vegan Kind, oh my god that's six, I think that's, and I was literally just looking at potentially signing up to Love Lula as well, which would make it seven, um, but then I'm thinking do I actually need to do that and I'm trying to just stop myself because I don't think I need to, so I'm going to go through all my makeup drawers and we'll just sort of show what I've got and then um yeah, so I'm a bit untidy because I've just, it's a bit of an um, impromptu video even though I've been thinking about doing it. So you'll see how I store my makeup and things and um, yeah, there we go. So I'm going to turn you around and let's go through these drawers. Okay, so first things first, I've got um, this set of like wide Alex drawers but I tend to have most of my stuff. So I, when I bought it, I thought, right, I'm going to try and get everything in here. Got a couple of bits and pieces sat on the top. I've got these drawers. I don't think I've got anything in the... Oh, I've got some craft stuff in these. I thought I might use these for some of my samples. Um, so those are pretty much empty. And there's a few bits just lurking on the top. So there's um, a bath bomb there I need to use. Um, a few bits from one of my latest boxes. I've got calendars, actually. This is just from the Debenhams calendar, I think. So there's a few bits I need to pack away here. Um, heel cream, I'm trying to look after my feet. Right, so in the first draft, I've tried to be quite methodical with these when I first got them. So, and I've used a lot of um, my old beauty boxes um, to try and keep things in sections. So this top one is looking at pretty much like base layers. Um, so in this back one here is mostly powders. So in here, I've got quite a lot of powders, so there's like some L'Oreal, Love Luna, I don't even know what I've got and it's just sat here, I've got a Laura Mercier there, I've not even used it, um, a few other powders, some face cream which is number seven, a couple of sponges, some more powders, Monica Da and the Nude by Nature, um, so that's them. Then I've got a couple of other sponges. Here's some little primers as well. So there's some MAC Prep and Prime, Too Faced, um, Poor Fashion. These are little samples. And this one, I've just got that. Um, this is like a, a facelift in a bottle. Still not done that. I want to do a review on that. More primers, primers, sponges primers, what's that, an illuminizer, um, got makeup brush cleaner, maybe need to use that a bit more, and use my MAC um, Fix Plus. In the back here there's some foundations, oh gosh, so yeah, quite a few there, a few more sponges, 
um, let me take this one out. So here I've got more foundations, um, some oil, and these are like different fixing sprays as well. So a few revolution things. Um, this in here I've got loads of um, serums, moisturizers, face oils, just different sort of skincare things that I've had out of beauty boxes. Again, I mean, it's going to take me forever to use this. And this is part of the thing, like, why? I mean, look, I've got two of these the same. Um, so it's like, why do I need to keep getting more and more boxes? How can I even... There's just so much stuff. I'm just never going to use it. What's this? Is this a Lizelle? There's a muslin cloth there from something. So here I've got a few concealers and things. And a, um, so there's an... Is that an eyeshadow base? Some different concealers. Um, so yeah, so that's sort of pretty much the top drawer. Um, so yeah, a lot of just base stuff. But this box here is just what made me start to realise that I don't need any more um, mystery boxes or limited edition boxes. I've got plenty. So that's that one. Coming down, um, so this is more like cheeks and highlighters and bronzers and things so in here is sort of pretty much highlighting type things is how i can best put it i have got stuff other places as well but um so yeah this has got this is a really nice one i got this out of my um look incredible last month it's so pretty i love it so yes there's that but, i mean how many do you need so I've got highlighter, 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 highlighter. So there's different powder ones. We've got like strobing pencils and things. Um, got some more like illuminators, strobe creams. Um, what's this? Dirty, I don't even know what I've got. Dirty little secret. That must be a strobe thing, I think. More strobe pencils here. So that's that, and again there, that's like a high beam benefit. This is um, star, star drops. <clears throat> so that must be more illuminating, strobe things. Um, Revolution, so there's a, a strobe palette there, never used it. Um, a Revolution highlight palette, again, never used once or twice. Um, the Balm, this is a um, palette for I think blush, cream blushes. Let's have a look, yep. Yeah. Really beautiful looking palette. But again, maybe use once or twice. Um, so then here I've got a um, sculpting kit again from Revolution. Never used. I've got a back a really big... Um, kit there so that, again this has got all your eyeshadows bronzers and powders and things massive never used <laughs> god um so bronze and sculpt palette here and um, another sculpting palette these are like all your bronzers and things and um, some liquid some cream bronzers bronzer bronzer and this is uh, like a Bron like a cream contour palette is it yeah contour kit from revolution um so this is like blushes like single blushes um so this is a mineral blush that i got from latest in beauty We've got bare minerals blusher l'oreal cyo there's a cream blush there's a little revolution one at the bottom pixie manicada that's really nice actually um just a benefit thing another benefit this one by Rimmel is lovely Snake. some singles in there Lottie by London Karl Lagerfeld um, that's another cream one so basically as you can see there's just loads and then oh my god these are palettes so I've got like this peachy brownie one I mean all these look pretty much new so I've got that um, a little highlighting 
Okay, what's that? Ultra Strobe and Light Palette. That looks nice. Um, little pinky blush one. Um, another blush one here. What's this? I'll just come like that. Another one. That's quite a nice one as well. And then another one here, still in the box, not used. So yeah, I don't think I need any more blushes. Um, oh, what? Are you there? I just dropped you. <laughs> so this one's getting a bit embarrassing now. This one is my eyeshadows palettes, just the palettes. Um, and I've literally got. I might do a separate video on my palettes. I think. But basically, oh my god, look at, oh, I don't even know how many I've got. I've got a couple there, there's a couple of different rose type coloured palettes, some Freedom, Revolution, more Revolution, Freedom, oh gosh, what's in the back here, so there's a little MUA, um, what's that, Maybelline, uh, Rimmel, um, another Revolution one. I've got loads of Revolution. Um, oh, this one's broken. But that one, I love this one. Burgundy Bar from Maybelline. That is a beautiful, if you love um, shimmers, this is a beautiful palette. Um, what else have we got in here? Oh, Lord, this is ridiculous. Let me pull them all out. You can't even see how far back they go. This is an old one. That's a... Um, Colour Riche, that'd be L'Oreal, more Revolution, um, more Revolution, Freedom, oh no, Revolution, Revolution, oh, sparkly, they're good for Christmas. Um, these are pretty old, oh, so there's a Coastal Scents, let me just open that. Oh, look at those, those are really pretty. I've got another Coastal Scents palette as well. Um, again, they're just sort of nice, strong colours, unusual colours. And they're magnetic pots, so you can just interchange them about. Little French Connection one, I must have got one Christmas as part of a set. And then over here, like, we've got loads of Revolution things. So, oh, look at this. So they are full try shadows, Tammy, Flawless 3, W7 Delicious. Another revolution, revolution. Oh, but anyway, basically, you're getting the idea that I need never buy any more eyeshadows. I've just got so much. Um, this one, Lightning Last, gave me. Thank you, my darling. It's gorgeous. I love that. These are really nice little cheapies. Like the girls with attitude. That's lovely. Um, another one there. Another one there. They're nice. Um, that was the one that you got as a limited edition freebie from look um, from Revolution when they hit one million um, followers on Instagram. A couple of sleep palettes, then my Jaclyn Hill palette, which I love. So yes, there's quite a few in there. <laughs> um, next, more eyeshadows. Um, so these are smaller palettes here. So a combination of just like little ones here there's a few sleek ones um like mini sleeks different quads and trios um absolutely loads these are all single single shadows so again i've got lots and lots and lots do say malakida cyo um there's also some uh, like liquid foiled ones um absolutely loads in there sharpener <laughs> pencils so these are all eye pencils and um, some liquid liners and um, gel liners so that's that um little hula kit that's quite good got a little um hula and all the little things in there i think i got that from birch box with my birch points um some brow things different brow kits and pencils and gels and um, benefit stuff um some lashes just some bobbles and grips what else is at the, is anything at the back here got some more lashes in there and then these are all mascaras so literally loads and loads of mascaras to use 
Um, coming down, oh, so this is the, oh, this is such a great kit. This is the Revolution Lip Vault. So basically there's 10 kits um, of the lip and the um, lip pencil and the lip kits. So there's five kits there. And then the bottom drawer, five kits there. They're a bit metallic, so it's harder to see. Just some lip balms. Oh, some couple of little makeup bags at the back. Um, some different sort of like reddishy glosses and liquid lips there. Um, lip pencils in here. Um, some more lipsticks there. And coming down to the bottom drawer, we've got nail things. So there's um, different nail kits. That's a really funky one. It's an ultraviolet kit. Some of the um, Sally Hansen nail kits. Oh, false nails, what's that? More nail kits. False nails, nail varnish remover. So here we've got glosses. And some lip liquid lips as well. More lipsticks. More lipsticks. Um, nail polishes in there. Right, coming around to my desk. Um, so I've got, I've got a few perfumes and things in there. Then my desk area is just a bit messy. Let me take the mirror. Hello. Um, so I've got some brushes, a few hair things here, a few bits and pieces. I need to sort this out because I'm wanting this to be things that I'm going to be using. Um, but I've got a few bits and pieces in there, some sample perfumes at the bottom. Um, yeah, just a few odds and sods. Got a few bits on this carousel that... Um, I sort of showed the other day so there's a few products on there um on my desk what else have i got just bits all over so um mascara hand cream some um what's this illuminating mixing cream just to pop in with your foundation to make it nice and um glowy so this drawer um tends to be just what i have just where I can grab things when I'm getting ready for work. It's just stuff that's that I use a lot. Um, so there's just some um, my micellar water, just for if I'm changing looks with our swatches and things. In here, I've got a lot of things that I just grab. So it's just like my everyday sort of bronzer, um, some BB cream, my sponge that I tend to use. Um, I'm loving this at the minute, this pencil, just some lips highlighters, a little blush, this, um, so yeah, there's a few bits and pieces there, just a mixture of mascaras, lipsticks, blushes, just everyday items, a few everyday sort of um, skincare things, so a little lip balm, a night cream if I'm in here, um, before I put my night cream on rather than in the bathroom, then I've just been using this everyday at the moment, so I've got this eye cream, been using this serum this moisturizer and i've been using this as my primer most days a little cheeky lip balm um the foundations that i'm currently using i've got three so i've just been using these so these just sit in here um my inhalers and my allergy tablets um a couple of wet wipes nasal sprays, lenses, um, eye drops, cotton wool and my favourite favourite eye makeup remover. So that's in that drawer. Then in here I've got a few things um, from my number seven advent calendar so I need to get these packed away into a little home. So that's from when I did the unboxing and those are sat in there. It's a lot of skincare, a few bits of makeup and things. So I've got all them. I have got, let me see if I can get it out. Oh, let me just move that. This is all the makeup from my L advent calendar. And it's all in here because I'm meant to be doing a video every day of um, and reviewing all the items that were in my L advent calendar. 
Um, so I'm meant to be doing a daily upload through December, so I do need to get a move on. Hopefully I'll be able to do that. It just depends how I go. I've got my um, little book here to remind me. I've written down what is for each day. So I shall try and do that. Now, also, I have just got... You've just seen in my video. I've just picked up these little storage things. I'm going to start. These are three. These are fab. Um, so I'm going to maybe start putting these in my drawers and dividing some of my makeup into these. But I have just bought another palette today because I'm an idiot. <laughs> so I've got another palette. Then coming round um, in here, this is going to be going. This is just for some crafty stuff, but I've got some overflow. I've got um, some face masks. Um, in here, lots and lots of face masks. Um, I've also got, oh, that's just some empties, a little sneak peek. And in here, I've got um, extra things that I'm going to be doing for giveaways and, and that I need to post out and things to people. So, loads of extra palettes that I've already got and I've got duplicates of. So, I'll be doing those at some point. Let me move this little thing out of the way because it's on wheels. And then here, oh, all those are full of um, other samples, oh my god. And then I've got products here, just loads of like um, body creams and things. Then here's like bath washes and, and bath samples and shower samples, more body lotions and things in there. It's just right to the back. Um, hair things, literally full of hair products, samples, hand creams and things in there. Um, more masks in here face masks some more hair treatments and things in there and um, some more some bigger samples here so it's like a foot scrub another hand and feet cream What's this oh some supplements might get those out and see if they work a few more bits from um fake tan and then some soaps and things there <laughs> Plus, I've got loads of stuff in my bathroom, um, which, you know, well, oh, do we go? Right, we'll go quickly, but there's, um, yeah, let's go have a look. Right, so in here, I've just got a little holder. It's just on my um, windowsill in my own suite, and it's <laughs> some of the stuff that I use um, just as when I'm, as for cleansing and things. So I've got a few things I need to use. I've got my hairband here. Um, I've got some stuff not opened yet, so like night creams. Um, oh, I love this, my Evlom cleanser. There's also um, Elemis cleanser in there. So I love those. Some hand cream, so I'm trying to put my hand cream on at bed. Some more eye makeup remover. I've also got a little mini um, micellar water. Um, foot cream again. And I've got some retinal treatment here. I've also got some um, of the glycolic acid, which I use a couple of times a week. Um, this is really, really good dupe for the Lizelle stuff. So cheap from Superdrug and it's fab. Um, more cleansers and things down there. And um, like cordially foaming cleansers. In here, I've just got a little tub where I just keep a top up of cotton pads. And a little facial scrub cleanser thing there. Um, this is really good. Um, body shop. Um, cleansing butter I absolutely love it um, it is really greasy it gets eye makeup off and everything um, some cleansing oil this is lovely um, Lizelle um, what have I got here oh, Philip Kinsley Elasticizer which I've used that this morning this I love there's a mini one of these from my L Advent calendar but this is a full size and this is um, like a rice um, exfoliating thing um, from Dermalogica and your skin just feels like glass and um, some little oil just beautiful sorry beautiful shower oil um, oh this is really nice as well I've nearly finished this and this is a night treatment mask um, from Dr Botanicals and it's so lovely and um, what else have we got oh I've not tried this yet that was that um, charcoal soap cleansing sponge thing it was a bit weird um quite a few of you have used it though then just some eye cream some night cream little um shower cap for when i do my philip kinsley and i just stick that on to keep it all in place so yeah let's go back 
and have another chat. I meant to say, I've also got this, which I've nearly finished. Um, jo sent me this, so thanks, darling. And I've got this as well, because I am trying to be really good, putting my, um, blah, 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 what am I going to call it, moisturising after my shower and stuff. Um, just in family bathroom as well, there's just a few other bits and pieces in here. So there's um, some more moisturiser that I try and use. I've um, got this one here as well, which is lovely. Um, and this is um, quite oil. It's, it's like an, a cream that's an oil. Um, your skin feels really soft, especially the following day after that. And then again, this is great for your elbows and your knees, anything that's really dry. The um, rest is just all normal bathrooms. <sighs> there I feel like I've confessed I feel better so I think I don't need to buy anything else and I almost feel like I should probably cancel um some subscription boxes but I am going to but I think if any start to really annoy me I'll just cancel my subscription because I've just come to the realization that even if I live to 100 and never buy anything else I don't think I'll finish everything I've got so yeah i'll probably be doing a few little giveaways and that i think through the year um of items that i've not used and i've got all those duplicate palettes so i might just start giving some away um so my thoughts are i'm thinking because i'm going to be doing a nurse spend what i'm going to do in the new year i'm going to start going back over palettes that i already own sharing them again so hopefully those of you that have already got them it'll just remind you that you've probably owned them already and that just just to encourage you just to like use what you've got. Do we need more things? How many um, warm palettes do we need? How many shimmery palettes do we need? How many dupes for um, like NARS orgasm blusher do we need? You know, it's like the only thing I'm going to be buying through the year is um, my foundation as it runs out or as with skin changes with the seasons, with the colours. So I'm allowed to buy foundation. And I was going to say mascara, having said that, I've got hundreds of mascaras. But I do love Bad Gal Bang. Well, any of the Benefit mascaras. So as long as I've got a Benefit mascara I can use, I'm happy to do that. But I'm going to try and even maybe use ones I'm not so keen on. I can use them for work and things like that. So, yeah, I need to just get used up. I'm really worried in case I've got some more stuff somewhere and I've forgotten about it. And um, But I think that's enough for now. So, thank you for watching. <laughs> Are you the same? Have you just got stuff everywhere? If you have and you want to make a video as well or share on Instagram, um, just tag me and or let me know and I'll come and have a look because I cannot be the only person that has got so much stuff. I mean, I've got how many serums and moisturizers and you know, it's how many do I need? I don't need this many. <laughs> Right, I'm gonna go. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you haven't um subscribed yet, please do. And um, I just love to have you on board and, and follow me and have your support. That'd be awesome. Um, give me a thumbs up if you like this type of video and leave me a comment. And um, don't forget the bell. See you soon, guys. Bye. <laughs>